I look so we look so rough. We look like we've been in the field for three days already. Don't I know. I'm gonna have dreadlocks by the time we go home. My hair is know, so right? skanky already. We're Hello. at a fan life festival. Hi. <laughs> and we're tired. It's been a long day already, hasn't it? Oh, typical and hutch nightmares to be fair <laughs> we're not organised no oh, so disorganised so last minute but hey we're here and we've actually had a glass of wine so we're a bit more chill sat yeah. down for minute, it's looking amazing here and it's, it's really it's fun only like what did he say so at, no 25 percent capacity at the minute there's a lot more people going to be here tomorrow it all starts and kicks off with music and regions there's chilled out acoustic isn't there there's uh, like fan life talks. yeah but like youtubes and stuff yeah, like that so. so it sounds really cool and there's so, stalls and, and markets and stuff, so yeah. Shopping! Cool. And display vehicles, like us! So yeah. we can go and have a, uh, yeah, have a little there. look around tomorrow, properly. Yeah, look over there. I don't know, what's that? I don't know. I'm going to zoom in. Hang on. Behind me. It looks like some... <laughs> we'll, we'll get closer. Um, yeah, we're going to go and get water. There, is. I don't know, did you get... Oh, I didn't bring the map. Oh, we're going to get lost. Great. <laughs> <laughs> It's not all full stairs, so we'll just like wander. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we'll get water and then we'll catch up with you tomorrow with some fun activities, hopefully. Water! It gets really big and it's We should fill that with wine, that's what we're going wrong. Don't we not look bad when we're going. <laughs> <laughs> Day number one. Let's go. in there as well isn't yeah, it it's like, um, we're just over a year full time enough yeah. yeah so um, it's a nice big size though isn't yeah. it that horse box was it yes yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so um so oh, yes. you know sort of suits us fine really yeah but do you have um, trouble parking it in places then do you wild camp or um we do some wild camp we did three months in ireland which was really good both north and you know sort of republic um and that was really good um We've got a friendly sort of campsite down in Devon that we can use as a base yeah. and things when we're down there and things and you know sort of, we've done a bit of wild camping not not as much in England as. You know. Do you find it difficult with the roads though? I mean like getting through not really. No, I mean, right. and stuff. We're in we Devon. can get anywhere a bin lorry can go. Yeah, that's yeah, true. that's true. Yeah, and it actually drives like a big car. Cause it's got really good power steering. Has it? Yeah. yeah. So, um, so you know it's it's one of those things you know sort of, there's a couple of lanes where we've sort of thought. No, we don't oh, I've got down the minute. Yeah. Like, oh, <laughs> well, the thing is, is people will reverse for us. Well, apart from that one woman the other week. No, yeah, they don't want a mess, yeah. do they? Oh, yeah. a bit of a Mexican standoff, was it? Yeah. So she just sort of like look, and you think, like, why are you driving in Devon when you can't find your reverse gear? Yeah. You know, it's just, it was just crazy. Half Seven and a half ten. Yeah. Need the other license for it, don't we? Yeah. yeah. We're both old enough. Yeah. Today. Well, I've got it on mine. My husband hasn't, but I can't imagine driving anything yeah. like that because I'm yeah. just like. <laughs> I don't think Dad would want you to drive anything. <laughs> <that big. laughs>
either on motorcycles or on little camper vans or scooters, but they've all had five star reviews in Waterstones. They're oh, quite well known. Cool. Wow. Really, really good yeah. travel books. That's the original one where I went from New York to Los Angeles solo, having never ridden a bike before. Oh, so please take wow. a look. Please come back later. Yeah, yes, of course. Make sure you're at 10 to 11 as well. 11, oh, I'm yeah. That one. Yeah. Oh. God, I've picked up a hundred. Oh, <laughs> that's really cool. Nice. Take it, you can order online. Online and stuff, yeah. So do you, can you um, do bespoke ones? Yeah. With like an idea? Yeah, that's how we're bespoke for now. Oh yeah, the dog. Oh, cute. Oh, that's right. Wow, that's amazing. Yeah. Uh, we'll do bespoke ones, it's like about three weeks to yeah. design to post it out to <laughs> lift off the bike, scrap all that and then start again. Wow. So you have to build everything. Excellent. That's so cool. Tonight. Thank you. Oh is it? Oh. Oh this is amazing. The bed up there. Yeah. The carpet closet off. This is really nice for that. Nice. I love the White, like creamy leather, yeah, that's too. really nice. And, and the marble the tops. Oh, these marble tops. Nice. Oh, look at this, man. Look at this. Oh, oh my god. And then there's a. Oh, that's the bedroom. Oh, look, it's a nice size kitchen, isn't it? Brent, you'd love this. <laughs> you want one this big, don't you? Got loads of work besides them as well. And the extra bed. Telling up there? About extra seat belts. Asking. Hmm. Do you have a shower? It's the one thing we didn't fit. No. Uh, water, in, if you've got a van or a camper, put showers and things, it's, it's difficult. We're on land where we, we've got that facility, so we didn't need you to. Didn't yeah. well, I've you could have, you space. space. Yes, yeah. I've designed yeah. it with that space on that it's side, yeah. it be a yeah. separate shower. Or what you know, uh, drying room if you've got wet clothing, mm. or if you can go scuba mm. diving, or, or, or skiing. Yeah, you know, like a wet room type. Wet room yeah. style, toilet separate. We could have put it all in one, but the layout worked mm. quite nicely. Like then yeah. we've obviously then to turn it into the dog bed, as you probably saw. <laughs> yeah, doodle sleeps in oh. there, and obviously a bit more blanket storage on top. But the space is there for a, and we've got all the equipment to fit it. I'm just slightly against. Yeah. Putting showery, damp water. Yeah. You know, it's bad enough mm. when you boil the kettle and you get that conversation. Yeah. Oh, that's floor as well. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this kitchen's gorgeous, though. We've got a space. Yeah, this, yeah, look at it. It's pretty much free. Thank you so much. I love it. I love you can it. Follow, uh, we've got a little channel with. Um, oh, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, just a little, it's just about the bus railing. Yes, I want to come across. Yeah. So yeah, Queenby Schooly. We've got yeah. Max Van in the back yeah. and uh, I two diesel eaters for here. We've got one that sits in here for the lounge and mm. one in the bedroom, both independent of each other. And having these windows, yeah. we get the crosswind because obviously oh, yeah, you don't normally get. Yeah, so get nice yeah. big windows. So that's why it's so light in here, I think, yeah. as well. Yeah. I walked in, I was like, oh, And no cupboards, no upper cupboards. Yeah. Yeah. And I made the door bang in the middle so your eye looks straight. Yeah. Yeah. Straight down the bus, so it, People don't realise there's a bedroom at the back. They, they think this is it, and then yeah. they go, oh, No, wonder you don't have any windows. And in 1978, yeah. the laws changed them out. You couldn't have windows. They had to do 50 50 because kids were climbing in there. Oh. But these are the buses they used in the movies. So when you saw a scene of all the girls, <laughs> <laughs> uh, all the ladies going past the trope with the boys and the girls. <laughs> <laughs> these are the buses they used. Was to that get... selling point for you? It's <laughs> <laughs> a talking point. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
was just, I'm looking for a little more home like this. So I'm like, oh, that's a perfect size for me. Oh, really? Can we have a look? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, cute. Sorry, I missed you. Hi. There's <laughs> oh, another one. <laughs> Yeah, I've got a little micro camper, but it's got no toilet, no shower, anything like that. So I just want to think. Yeah. yeah. I can live, properly really. live in, really. Yeah. yeah. Stand up in and stuff. But do you have solar panels? No. No, no. not yet. No. Yeah, well, I've got, that's another thing. I've got do. a fast white dish. Nice. <laughs> All my free few needs. <laughs> oh, you don't yeah. live in it. No, no, no. No, no we just use it for going out. Yeah. The day. We've always done it, whether it be a motor home, in caravan, yeah. or whatever. We've always done it. Yeah. Something, yeah. But we've just come back to just being simple again now. Yeah. And it doesn't. It, it's not. Well, it does have everything you need. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. No, it's fine. <laughs> Take care. Thank you so much. <laughs> Oh yeah. Yeah, that's good. That's cool. That's pretty like good. mine. Yeah. Bigger. A bit bigger than mine, yeah. That is a bit taller, isn't it? Yeah. It's cute though. from a charity oh, love shop. That. Love a bargain. And yeah. that, oh, that's adorable. So when I went away with my friend just for the night in Bracken mm. and it poured down, it was so nice to have a toilet inside because yeah. my toilet will fit under the bed. Oh, and then I, I can make a coffee. Yeah. I, I don't think I cook a whole like full English breakfast or something no, in there. Could. But, yeah. you know, a coffee, a hot water bottle mm. in the winter and a oh, toilet, good. that's what I really wanted. Yeah. yeah. But when you have the double boot jumps, they basically fill the whole, the whole van. Thing, yeah. Yeah. When they're set up, they fill the van, and then you've got to have an awning. You know, I have got a big awning that fits yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. So you've got. But if I'm going away for a week, it's great to set it all up yeah. as a kitchen and everything. Yeah. But um, just for you, just to get away, and if you need an away, it's, away or it's two ideal nothing. for one. Because oh, I wanted something quite new. It's only three years old. Yeah. So uh, it suited yeah. me. Nice. No, great. So I'm actually going to put this vlog into two parts because I'm having just too much fun and excitement. I can't jam it all into one vlog. So please subscribe so you can watch the next video and find out what we got up to and how the rest of the festival went. I'm having such an awesome time. So see you in the part two of Van Life Festival 2022. <laughs>
you can hide Gonna find you and take it slowly Ready or not, here I come You can hide, gonna find you and 